name's Jamie, and I am at the Ronald McDonald House. You can't see on the other side of it. It's a giant new expansion. And this is Jacob Dreyer. Hello. Hello. You're in charge of uh, communications and marketing for the house? I am. So what's a three million pop tab donation mean to the Ronald McDonald House of Rochester? Well, our pop tab program brings in about ten to fifteen thousand dollars every year, and that's without a donation like this. So we're looking at you know thousands of dollars that are going to be helping children and families who stay at the house. Uh, easily one of the largest donations of pop tabs that we've ever received. It's it's wild, and uh, I talked to Jim for a little bit on Instagram, and he just did it because he wanted to, and he's been collecting for thirty years. Yeah, we've been in touch with him a couple of times over the years, but he really told us that he was doing this for the children and families. He wanted it to come to our house, um, and so we just made sure we could accommodate as best as possible when he said this was the summer he wants to deliver it. And really, what a great representation of what you can do for the house. Not right. everyone has the money always to donate to, to organizations, but everyone can collect pop tabs from young children all the way up to Jim, and he's been doing it for 30 plus years. So it's just, it's just great. It's great. It is impressive. Our house, now that it's expanded, will soon house 70 families. And I mean, this type of donation, this type of money is just really speaks to the people who care about the families who stay here. Right. Uh, we are a house that's funded by the community. And so even to have him come all the way from Medford to, to show his love for these families, uh, it'll help everyone. World record guy, right there. What made you decide to collect all the pop tabs? 30 years ago, there was a guy that I knew had got his boy got to stay here because he had cancer. Okay. And I figured, well, that's something I want to do. And I don't want no, no money out of it. I figured it's best that the people know what they're doing and charity work is one of the number one thing for me right well it's an amazing atmosphere here in this house because everyone is dealing with something and they understand each other you know families getting together and supporting each other yeah oh. is that the way it's supposed to be though it is it absolutely is the way it's supposed to be this whole street is full of and a little bit over there are homes for people dealing with different issues. This one's for kids down there. There's someone dealing with transplants a little over there. There's people dealing with cancer. It's an amazing town, and we really appreciate you helping. Well, I enjoy it. That's when when people tell me that I shouldn't do this, and I says, "Well, do you ever do you do any charity work?" No. Well, I says, "Well, why don't you let me do it? What I want to do." Yeah. Oh, it's, not it, it's, a, it's a good thing to do. It's not cost me anything except, you know, put a little bit of gas in that. Yeah. And then my shop where I'm renting from, got plenty of room. And heck, you might even be setting a world record here. I hope so. <laughs> well, what do you do in real life when you're not collecting pop tabs? Nothing, because I'm retired. <laughs> I used to be a garbage man. How many years did you do that? 50. Wow. That is... That would have given you great access to pop tabs too, but that's hard work. Yes, it is. Yeah, I enjoy doing it like this, and and I, I was telling people that uh, they sh they should all be people that go and do things for somebody else. Amen. Well, you know, we're a big community. The whole world is, and we got to stick together. Right. Well, it's hard to do it because a lot of people don't believe that. Right. Well, thank you. I'm gonna go look at some of your pop tabs. Okay. There's plenty of them. So how many pop tabs do you figure just in these buckets? There should be about 1,600 in a bucket. Oh my gosh! Yeah. <laughs> that is wild.